गुड आफ्टरनून स्टूडेंट्स यू वॉन्ट टू डिस्कस अबाउट ऑप्टिक्स इन क्लास इलेवेन चैप्टर फोर्टीन इन ऑप्टिक्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू वॉन्ट टू इंट्रोड्यूस ऑप्टिक्स वाट इज ऑप्टिक्स ऑप्टिक्स मीन्स इट इज द स्टोरी ऑफ लाइट और विजन द टॉपिक्स इन विच वी विल स्टडी अबाउट द लाइट और विजन इज कॉल्ड ऑप्टिक्स दिस मीन्स दिस इज द ब्रांच ऑफ फिजिक्स विच डील्स द स्टडी ऑफ लाइट इज कॉल्ड ऑप्टिक्स इन ऑप्टिक्स वी हैव डिफरेंट टर्म्स टू टू डिफाइन ऑप्टिक्स एंड इन ऑप्टिक्स वी हैव टू इंट्रोड्यूस डिफरेंट डिफरेंट टर्म्स लाइक रे ऑफ लाइट वाट यू मीन बाई रे ऑफ लाइट रे ऑफ लाइट मीन्स पाथ ऑफ लाइट मीन्स अ रे ऑफ लाइट इज द पाथ अलॉन्ग विच लाइट ट्रेवल्स लाइट ट्रेवल्स अलॉन्ग विच लाइट ट्रेवल्स इज कॉल्ड अ रे ऑफ लाइट इन दिस वे अ रे ऑफ लाइट मीन्स अ स्ट्रेट लाइन टू विच लाइट ट्रेवल्स दिस मीन्स पाथ ऑफ लाइट अ स्ट्रेट लाइन इज कॉल्ड अ रे ऑफ लाइट and if we collect a different ray of light in a place means collection of large number of rays of light is called beam of light beam of light means a collection of large number of rays of light is called beam of light they may be in this figure we are studying about left side or ray of light means straight line with arrow head and second is convergent beam convergent beam means a light a ray of light are meeting at a point is called convergent beam and divergent beam means a ray of light are departing from a point is called divergent beam convergent and divergent beam means a ray of light departing from a point and in this figure we have done wrong to to know that can we can you deduce at what can then you you can find here is wrong you have to comment into the comment box in this figure here is wrong so ray of light convergent beam light divergent beam means in which figure we have wrong you have to find out and write into comment box okay we have study optics in optics topic array of light convergent beam divergent beam optics means study about light optics is the branch of physics which study about light and array of light convergent beam divergent beam array of light convergent beam divergent beam now parallel beam means collection of parallel rays of light is called parallel beam in in this figure we have a parallel beam now in figure 1 in figure 1 here ao is incident ray which is incident on any surface xy and is after incident it is reflected along ob means returning to the same path along ob so when light ray is incident in any surface and reflected back to returning sorry returning back to same medium it is this phenomenon is called reflection of light means reflection of light is that what the phenomenon of the phenomenon of returning back of light when it is incident on any surface is called reflection of light the phenomenon of returning back of light to the same medium when it is incident on any surface is called reflection of light reflection of light at plane surfaces means the phenomenon of returning back of light in the medium the same medium or medium when it falls on the surface is called reflection of light then we know 
लॉज ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन लॉज ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन दे आर एटलीस्ट टू लॉज ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन मीन्स द इंसिडेंट रे द रिफ्लेक्टेड रे एंड द नॉर्मल एट द पॉइंट ऑफ इंसिडेंट ऑल लाइ इन द सेम प्लेन इन पीफीएस फिगर वी हैव इंट्रोड्यूस्ड दैट इंसिडेंट रे द रिफ्लेक्टेड रे एंड नॉर्मल एट द पॉइंट ऑफ इंसिडेंट आर लाइंग एट द सेम प्लेन मिडल एट पॉइंट ओ मीन्स सेम प्लेन एक्स वाई प्लेन सो दिस इज फर्स्ट लॉ ऑफ लॉज ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन एंड सेकेंड लॉज वी आर इंट्रोड्यूसिंग द एंगल ऑफ इंसिडेंस इज इक्वल टू द एंगल ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन द एंगल ऑफ इंसिडेंस मीन्स इंसिडेंट रे मेकिंग एंगल विथ नॉर्मल इज कॉल्ड एंगल ऑफ इंसिडेंस इज इक्वल टू द एंगल ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन रिफ्लेक्शन एंगल ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन मीन्स द इंसिडेंट द रिफ्लेक्टेड रे मेकिंग एंगल विथ द नॉर्मल इज कॉल्ड एंगल ऑफ रिफ्लेक्शन now we are introducing two figures for regular reflection and irregular reflection in figure second first here what the angle of incidence is equal to angle of reflection here the angle of incidence is equal to angle of reflection means this angle of reflection and this angle of reflection are same but in this figure rough surface is the angle of incidence angle of reflection angle of incidence angle of reflection this angle of reflection and this angle of reflection are different in this way we can define regular reflection and irregular reflection regular means regular reflection irregular means diffuse reflection also we can define regular or diffuse reflection in regular reflection what will happen the incident beam makes same angle of reflections the incident beam means one light ray one light ray collection of light ray are incident they are incident beam max angle of reflection this angle of reflection this angle of reflections are equal all same but irregular reflection but irregular reflection the incident beam max different angle of reflections that is called irregular angle of reflections and now after this i want to so derivation about deviation of light in deviation of light we introduced you so derivation of angle of deviation angle of deviation means what in this case first of all first case i want to define glancing angle glancing angle means the angle made by incident ray to the surface angle made by incident ray to the surface is called glancing angle means ao angle making with surface xo is called glancing angle this is glancing angle and in this case angle of deviation what is angle of deviation means angle between emergent ray and the reflected ray is called angle of deviation the angle between reflected ray and emergent ray is called angle of deviation so we we can define here first of all regular reflection means what same angle of the incident beam has same angle of reflections is called regular reflections the incident beam has different angle of reflections are called irregular reflections glancing angle angle made by the incident beam with the reflecting surface angle of deviation angle made by the reflected ray with the emergent ray are angle of deviation now here is derivation for derivation of a figure we can derive angle of deviation what what we have to derive angle of deviation is equal to twice the glancing angle angle of deviation is equal to the twice the glancing angle we have to derive here in our figure let us consider xy we have plane mirror here x y e up is a plane mirror and when a ray of light a o is incident at point o on the above figure on the surface of the mirror with glancing angle theta means incident ray is incident on the surface of a mirror with glancing angle theta the ray is reflected along ob as in figure first and 
after an incident on the surface the ray is reflected along ob as in figure first and if no is a normal drawn at point o no is a normal drawn at point o then aoc is the path of incident ray before reflection before reflection aoc is the path of incident ray the angle d is angle between the reflected ray and the emergent ray so it is called angle of deviation so we have some figure angle of deviation d equal to angle boc equal to angle boi plus angle yoc so equal to angle boi in figure we have 90 degree my theta means 90 degree minus r boi means 90 degree minus r plus angle yoc is opposite angle of glancing angle theta so this is angle yoc is theta so equal to 90 degree minus i plus theta and 90 degree minus i means how we know that in reflection of light angle of incidence is equal to angle of reflection so r we have placed here in place of r i we can write